So we're all getting in the van because we're heading off down to Blackpool Pier. We're going to go and have a look at some of their attractions. And we're also going to catch the sun setting on the Irish Sea. Um, yeah, didn't feel too windy. Last time we went to Blackpool Pier, it was chucking it down full of rain and it was windy as hell. Um, so I've taken precaution and this time I'm going to wear a hat just in case it gets windy because last time my hair just went everywhere just totally went out of shape and that way uh, my hood best part of the way um, I don't know if any of you guys remember that vlog last time we were at Blackpool was about I think it was about 9 to 10 months ago last year uh, we stayed in another Haven caravan park up in the Lake District called Lakeland and that was a really good place to, to stay as well um, but yeah we're just waiting for Dion um, to come I think everybody else is in the van is everybody else packed in there? Yeah, can I have the keys for the back so I can get everyone in their coat? Yeah, yeah. yeah I think I'll put Khaleesi's um, teddy bear coat on here as well. Just yeah, I, I would, yeah, because I'm on the seafront. Yeah. Okay, I'll get this back door's open. Should I put it on when we're down there? Should I put it on here now? Um, just do when we're down there. It makes no difference. But yeah, everybody's packed in the van. And i um, just waiting for Dion now. Khaleesi's just having a little bottle. She's not now. Isn't she not? Just oh. staring at you like, what the hell's that? <laughs> yeah. Excuse me, guys, I've just thrown my hair up because it gets me away. Yeah. Um, but go and check my Instagram stories out if you're not following me on Instagram because I recorded her this morning and she was very, very chatful and she's actually speaking away. So I've caught that on camera, <laughs> which I'm so glad about. <laughs> but so cute. But she was having a full on conversation with us. <laughs> Where do you sweet heart? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you just want your attention. <laughs> right, last but not least, the marvellous Dion. She got changed because it was too cold. Yeah, I wouldn't be wearing a skirt down at Blackpool. You get blown away with the wind. Like but as I said before, it doesn't feel too windy at the moment. Are you wearing your boots or your trainers? Trainers are probably a look better. They're both ball. Whatever you want to wear. Boots. Boots. Okay. okay, let's go. I'll lock everything up in there. Bikes away, electric scooters away. Okay, so we're now in Blackpool and we are walking up just past the South Pier. We have the big Blackpool Pleasure Park behind me. Um, just on the left hand side there is the Blackpool's Water Park. Check out that bad boy guys. Gotta come back to do that. And the Pleasure Park, oh my word, the roller coaster looks absolutely huge. It looks so scary. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. So we've just seen some um, horse and carriages a little bit further up, so we're gonna have a little walk further up and see if we're can get a horse and carriage um, and have a little tour around Blackpool. We've just missed the little horse and carriages there, they've just picked up some customers so we're going to break a little bit of time and explore the bottom end where the pleasure park is and we're just walking past the huge massive outdoor water park. Looks absolutely epic doesn't it? It does, it looks sick, we might do that tomorrow. It actually shows you on the screen as well. Yeah they've got an outdoor like video and showing everybody like what it looks like inside but give you guys There's a little peek. over there as well for the pleasure park. Have they? Oh, on that side. Oh, yeah, that's what that is. Oh, look at the water fountain. Come yeah. on, we'll have a walk down to the water fountain, yeah? Yeah. Why not? Looks so, so nice. Yeah. Looks, just... Blackpool looks really, really nice and all lit up. So it's a six mile light show and it's a free light show as well. Yeah, they do ask for don do uh, donations um, a little bit further up, but it's up to you if you want to donate or not. We donated a couple of pounds, didn't we? Yeah, it goes to the light show though. So Does it? Like maintaining it and then the next Paying the year. workers and stuff probably. Um, but yeah, the pleasure park um, just looks absolutely epic. Stephanie is right, the roller coaster looks huge. Check out this, guys. Look at the size of that roller coaster. Absolutely epic. It's huge, isn't it? Yeah. 
seen the big drop on that side over there. I don't know if I'll be going on that for my first ride. Since <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I haven't been on any ride for over a year now, guys. I don't know if I'll be doing that straight away. <laughs> They've got the little train for the kids down here. It's all lit up. <laughs> See ya. <you>. Bye. <laughs> so Stephanie's taking the pink one with the nice little Dulex cozy seats. Got like putting uh, cushion pattern on the bottom. And we're all just chilling in this lovely blue one. What do you guys think? Scary. It's really fast on the video. Look at that. It's way faster than the cars. Yeah. This one's quite fast. But not as fast as the legend scooter. They're doing decent. Decent speed. They are just horses. <laughs> do you feel like a right princess? <laughs> do you feel like a princess, Sean? Yeah. <laughs> what do you look? Yes, she's a kid. <laughs> So I feel like Cinderella in her little carriage going to the ball, but I don't feel like I'm dressed for the ball. <laughs> We've got Khaleesi as well. This is your first little time on an horse and carriage, Khaleesi. And she's like, Mama, I'm just going to sleep all the way through it. <laughs> yeah, she's fast asleep. She has no idea what's happening. It's so pretty. It's pink. Isn't it? Are you tiny? Yeah, it's really Yeah, pretty. the hair is kind of like pink. It's like pink. Oh, it's a light colour thing, guys. So this was £25 pounds. You can get up to six people in it and, and it is a two mile journey. Beauty lives in me I know I don't yet know it So I trust you when you say That beauty lives in me too Too we're going to have a little romantic time out of Blackpool with your partner. Have you got the kids with you? You have a hotel booked up there or something? Come and take a little cheeky bottle of champagne. Sit here, pop the champagne open. Are you allowed to stand up? That's really great. Huh? Yeah. Where's the one in front of us. We just finished up on our little horse and carriage ride guys that was so fun and entertaining um, the prices were 25 pound each and we just went up the road and then back down so in terms of expensiveness I think it's average uh, you do get experience Blackpool in their little princess carriages um, probably absolutely beautiful if you're a little girl it's probably something you'd really enjoy uh, we just did it because Dion wanted to do it and baby Khaleesi as well and then Caleb wanted to do it as well so that's why we did it for and you can't come to Blackpool and not experience the full experience so that's what we did uh, but we're going to head off into the van now drive further up and then we're going to experience a little bit more of what's got to offer further up on the North Pier I think is it the North Pier we're going up to now? Yes, the South, south. This yeah. is the South Pier So we purposely decided to come down on the night time because of the lights um, and basically we've now been to Blackpool on the night time we've always came during the day so it's been a nice experience to experience and a little something different for us all as well. So 
So we've just finished up on the North Pier. I think it's also known as Pirates Bay as well. And we're going to head up a little bit further up the road to Blackpool Tower to get a nice lovely picture. I must say it's a much better place to come when it's all lit up. We came here during the day once and it looked nice but it just wasn't like as vibrant as it is today. So yeah, I would definitely recommend coming on a night time and especially when they've got the light festival on. It just looks so so pretty. Really gets you in the festive mood. crunchy that one does that looks really gooey that's gonna definitely put you in a food coma so these are five pounds each yeah so good. <laughs> we didn't show them fish and chips though did we oh no we didn't show fish and chips guys but we actually these because these look so good 